Hi guys, welcome back. It's your boy Doggy Douglas here, and today in this video we're going to show you a detailed version of lagging people out your session. So, as you can see, I'm just getting into a random car. You know, just so you know that I'm not like like recording parts and missing bits out for you, which I wouldn't do that. This is the exact way you're going to do everything. I've put in every single bit. So, I'll screenshot the parts which I couldn't record. So, all we're going to do is lag as many people out and it should come up that you will be in a solo session. In uh, private, but solo. Private, no, not private. Public, but solo, by yourself. So, all we're going to do first, as you can see, we've got 27 people in. So all we're going to do is go onto the home screen and we're going to go across and get to all the way across until you get to the settings. So as you'll see I'm flicking through a few of these, I might speed these up. Yeah, I've sped these up a little bit, just just a bit, now I jump in. So from there we're going to like I say get to settings from there all we're going to do is scroll down to time and date settings which is simple that is you know it's just one of these we'll show you going down do 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 so yeah time and date settings and actually while I'm flicking down these this is actually really good glitch to use say you want to do uh, CEO work or your MC work, but you don't want people to come and destroy your car uh, cargo or any of that. This is the best method. Lag people out, f one out, and this method as well. The think a solo car duplication, which is still working. If you get into a public session, do the dupe on the car first, then you lag people out this way. You can do it all on your own. You don't need anyone. So you've not got the risk of people blowing your car up, your duplicate car, as you're duplicating the uh, car, the street car duplication. I'm on about that. So we get to time and day, and now all we're going to do from time and day, change the month, go set manual, and from there it will be go across to the month and change the month to the third. You know. Then, from that point, all we're going to do is jump straight back to GTA and go on GTA. Your character will be frozen. I won't show you that part, but your character will be frozen. And then you're going to jump back to time and date. And from there, you're going to go in, time and date settings again. And then you're going to use set, uh, set using internet. And that will reset the time and date. So set now. As you can see, it will load a little bit, which is decent. All right. And from there, like I say, please, please wait. I couldn't record that, so I had to take a screenshot for you. And there you go. Back in. F1. It comes up F1 to left. Such a good glitch. No. And um, like you say, you can do so many things now, you know, CEO works, any of that stuff. I don't personally do that myself, but I used to. I was in that depart like that point where I needed to try them out. But anyway, that's today's video and I'll see you in the next one. Boom boom.